most books when they show the map of Israel, they don't show the real borders of Israel, they include Palestine in it, they show you what is called the greater land of Israel, if you see even the names of the books are never in geography, never the state of Israel, but the land of Israel, which is which is different. So I think we have like three generations of students who don't even know what the borders are. And the people who live uh, in the territories, the non-Jews, they are, they are, they are always uh, labeled non-Jews. So this is another racist way to label people as not us, not what they are, but what they are not. And these non-Jews who live in the territories are either presented as foreign labor, that coming into the into Israel to work, so like from Thailand or China, not people who really live in in the place where they live, uh, or they are not represented at all. Some maps uh, tell you, for example, there are population maps in geography textbooks where the whole what you should call Palestine is is a blank blank spot, no color, nothing, and they tell you. For this area, we have no data. So in a population map, if you have no data, it means there are no people there. And if it's colorless, it means that it is not inhabited.